welcome to flyguys.net. It's Clint here, aka Blasty. Today we are going to be tying the electric lettuce damsel. These little fellas are um, pretty lively in the water, especially under an indicator or on a retrieve. So what you'll need for this fly is some um, chartreuse tying thread. Chartreuse, extra small ultra wire, some light olive marabou feathers, and essentially what you want is pre-tied pre uh, chain eyes. These are all extra small uh, chain eye, and they're coated with Gulf fluorescent chartreuse UV resin. I also give them a coat of Sally Hansen's for extra durability. Um, and you'll also want some olive scudback. I've already pre-notched this. It's a little easier to do before you tie it onto the fly. And that resemb resembles the wing case. So to get started, just take your tying thread, bring it on to the hook shank it on and you want to get some marabou for the tail I also forgot to mention that you're gonna need some dubbing I call this my electric lettuce dub so it is one part light olive rabbit, one part olive rabbit, and then a dark olive ice dub. So equal parts. I mix up a bunch because I use it for leeches, damsels, shrimp, you name it. All right, so tie on your marabou. Make sure you wrap it on the back so the tail stays in position. You can always shorten up those fibers at the end if the tail's a little bit too long. And then you want to tie in your chartreuse ultra wire ribbing. Bring it right back to where you tied it onto the tail. And Next, just getting some dubbing. You want a pretty sparse noodle. Sparse as you can get it, you're gonna brush it out anyways. I always like to put a little bit of Sally Hansen's on the shaft of the hook to help anchor the dubbing. You don't have to, but I like to. So just wind your dubbing on. Nice touching turns. Right up to the chain eyes. Give it a little whip finish just for durability. Then you want to wind on your ribbing. Reverse direction as the way you dubbed the fly. And just tie that off. Once it's tied off, you can helicopter it off instead of wrecking your nice scissors. Once you've got that, then I just position the wing case. A little fork section goes back about halfway down the body or so. 
I do ever increasing tension turns on this to get it into position. I don't like that, so I'm gonna start over again. Once you got the wing case into position, you might want to just alter the position. I bring the tying thread forward. We're going to do another little small noodle of dubbing. This one's got to be really sparse. And just wrap that behind the wing case and in front of it. And then just figure eight it over the eyes. And bring your wing case forward. Give it a good stretch. Cut off the excess. A little bit of Sally's if you want. There's pretty much the finished product. You can shorten the tail fibers by just pulling some lengths off. Put it back in the vise. Get your dubbing brush. Tease out the fibers a little bit more. And there you have it, the electric lettuce damselfly. Coming to a lake near you. Thanks for watching.